Fertilization is the process by which the male's sperm cell fuses with the female's egg cell, ovum, resulting in the formation of a single new cell called the zygote. This marks the starting point of a new individual's development. During sexual intercourse, millions of sperm are ejaculated into the female's vagina. Sperm must swim through the cervix and uterus to reach the fallopian tube, where they might meet the egg. At the same time, the ovary releases an egg during ovulation, which enters the fallopian tube and can be fertilized within about 24 hours. Only a few hundred sperm reach the egg, and just one will penetrate it. To fertilize the egg, the sperm must first pass through two protective layers, the corona radiata and the zona pellucida. The sperm releases special enzymes, acrosomal reaction, to dissolve these layers and make entry possible. Once one sperm penetrates, changes in the egg's membrane prevent other sperm from entering. The sperm enters the egg, bringing its genetic material, and its tail is left behind. The egg completes the final steps of division and forms a female pronucleus, while the sperm's genetic material forms the male pronucleus. The two pronuclei move towards each other and fuse. This fusion combines their genetic material, creating a unique set of chromosomes, 46 total, forming a zygote. The zygote rapidly divides by mitosis turning into a ball of cells called a blastocyst as it moves towards the uterus. About five to six days after fertilization, the blastocyst implants into the uterine lining where it begins to grow and develop, marking the beginning of pregnancy. Fertilization typically occurs in the ampulla region of the fallopian tube. Only one sperm fertilizes an egg. This ensures that the resulting zygote has the correct number of chromosomes. The sex of the baby is determined at fertilization, depending on whether an X or Y carrying sperm fertilizes the egg. For more interesting videos, like and subscribe.